What if you could turn one piece of content into a LinkedIn post, a Twitter thread, an email, and a blog post, all automatically using AI? Now, I'm not talking about creating generic fluff. I'm talking about creating high quality, specifically tailor-made content for each social media platform. How much do you think this will be worth? <laughs> Let me answer that for you. So Heel Bloom, Ali Abdul, Stephen Bartlett, Alex Omozi have all revealed that they spend hundreds of thousands of dollars paying content teams. Now, what if I was to tell you i've learned how to do this using an automation service called make and created an automation flow which does all of this for you and in this video i'm going to break down exactly how i created this and not only that i'm going to give you a step-by-step -step guide on how you can implement this directly into your business or sell this as a service and start making thousands of pounds. Hands down, this is gonna be the best video I've ever made. So make sure to stick around to the end because I'm going to give you the pre-made automation so you can just copy and paste this straight into make and don't have to do all the hard work, but you need to watch the video to understand how to use it. I know automations and AI agents seem complicated, but I've made this as simple as possible. So just click where I click, follow along with me step by step, and you'll be able to implement this into your business. Now, if you're a content creator right now and you're not shaking with excitement, honestly, picture this. You can get a YouTube video, it's gonna transcribe it for you, it's gonna then run a prompt through ChatGPT to make it into a Twitter thread, a LinkedIn post, an email, so you can automatically ping out a funnel so people can come and watch your video. This is so, so valuable, and I wish I'd learned this sooner, but I'm gonna take you through building this automation on Make today. Without further ado, make sure to like the video for the value, subscribe to the channel, and let's jump into the step-by-step -step tutorial. Okay, so there's two automations that I'm gonna take you through. The first one simply just allows us to upload a file to Google Drive, and then it automatically is going to organize that file in a software called Airtable, which is basically like Google Sheets. By the way, I'm gonna show you the full automation run through my first trial of this at the end of the video. And I'm gonna drop you all of these done for you automations as a template below. They'll be linked down below so you can check all of this out. The second part of the automation is then I can go into Airtable and basically trigger a workflow. So that basically means I can just set it to start doing the task, which is turning my YouTube video into a transcribed piece of text. And then it's going to make those other five pieces of content from that. So this is what this second automation is. And this honestly blows my mind. This application make, if you're a business owner <laughs> or if you're an aspiring entrepreneur, you want to start making money online, learn how to build automations on this software called make. It's all literally drag is visual. It's quite easy to learn. And there's so many things that it can integrate with. And there's so many done for you templates that you can have a play around with, but I'll talk about that a little bit later on. So let me just explain what this automation is, because I know you're probably questioning my integrity in the intro when I said that there's an automation that allows you to create all those pieces of content automatically for you from one click. And I wasn't lying, I was being legit. So let me just quickly talk you through this automation flow and how each stage actually works. But before I go any further, I just want to show you guys the capabilities of this software make. So it can connect to a bunch of different apps. I'm talking like 300 plus different applications for automations like this. So I've literally only scratched the surface with the things in my business I can automate. And I highly recommend you guys come in and check in some of these apps that they can connect with. Now, I know this probably seems overwhelming with having the complete freedom to build these automations from scratch, but here on their website, they actually have a really useful section where they talk about use cases to try and give you some inspiration as to how you can actually use this software. Again, this might seem overwhelming, but they've actually got a bunch of done for you templates which actually explains what the template is and how it can obviously be implemented. And look, if you go actually on Make itself, you'll see that they've got a list here of templates and you can scroll through and there's so many of these. It shows how many people have actually used these automations. And honestly, like uh, I wish I'd found this sooner and I'm so glad that I have it now and I'm starting to build on it. And if you guys are interested in videos about Make and the different automations that I build, let me know in the comments and I'll make them for you or let me know of things that you'd like me to try and build and I'll make them and provide the templates for you. And if you want to try this, the pro 
pro plan's only $18 and my top link will give you 30 days free to test out the pro plan. Okay, so without further ado, let's build this automation. So we've created a folder in Google Drive and you just wanna upload your video to this folder, which will be inbox. And then what's going to happen is this automation is gonna start and it's simple as it's gonna basically take this file, it's gonna create a new folder in Google Drive after the same name of your YouTube video. And then it's gonna move the YouTube video into that new folder, which just means you can visually see that this video has been processed. So let's run this, cause I've got it set to run every 15 minutes. So let's run this now. It'll pick up this file, it'll create a new folder, it'll move it there and it will create a new row in Airtable. And don't worry guys, I've literally done all of this for you. So the templates will be down below. You'll be able to use this and do this step by step without having to build it. So let's go back to Google Drive. And as you can see in the inbox, if we refresh it, the inbox is now empty. And if we go back to transformations, there's a new folder called my video title and then my video is actually in there. So that's the first automation done. And <laughs> as you can see, it's so simple. And here you've got visual cues of everything that's happened. And honestly, I don't understand code or anything technical really that's going on, but makes visual workflows for this automation makes it really easy to understand. So the next section of the automation start when I go into Airtable and I trigger this workflow. Imagine a trigger basically just means I press start. So the way I do this is I come here and I do a drop down and I start whichever workflow I wanted to create, but the automation I've built runs all of them once I start the YouTube video. So I'm going to click start this one. It's going to automatically open and start the YouTube title and description. Then it's gonna generate this webhook trigger, which basically means it's gonna go through automatically gonna start running this function. And as we can see, it's created a new record. It's downloaded the file from Google Drive. It's then transcribed it. And then in the router here, it's going to create a YouTube title and a YouTube description in ChatGPT. And then it's going to run through and it's going to trigger these other workflows, which is basically start these other columns in Airtable. So if we look, there we go. And now it's triggering these all other automations. So as you can see, it's done the YouTube title and description. And then if we go into the other automations, it's now running these other ones. So video to blog automation is doing the same. And as you can see, it's now transcribing the video again, which is something I think is clunky and I'm going to improve on to make it all run from just the transcription once. And then it's going to bring this information into Airtable. So if you go into the look at the blog and the blog's done, but it's actually done all of them at the same time. And you'll be able to open these up and see them. So the way that this works is that Airtable is basically like the messenger between your actual file in Google Drive and Make, which is what's running all the automations between ChatGPT, et cetera. So this is why you need to set up using my template below a table with this and then the transformation and automations in Airtable, which then has a webhook for each one of these things. So honestly, guys, how crazy is this? I've made the template for you. It'll be linked down below and you'll be able to just jump straight in and start doing this for yourself. So if you're thinking, whoa, this seems a bit complicated and I don't want to do this exact automation that I've done in this video, even though I've literally done it all for you and the templates are below, don't just stop learning about this because there's a bunch of different templates that are really simple, ready and already done for you that can streamline your entire business and make your work so much easier and faster. I definitely recommend you guys going and checking this out and just having a look through these templates, watching a few other videos about their software, because I guarantee it's gonna improve your workflows, increase your efficiency and make your day-to-day -day business so much easier. Now, there's so many of these templates and I'm brand new to the software as well. And I have the privilege of being able to bring you new things that I find as soon as I find them. So I do apologize if this seems scattered and chaotic because I'm just genuinely really excited by the possibilities of this. 
success. And I just want to reinforce, if you guys want me to try and make any other automations that have come to mind, now you've seen what's possible, let me know in the comments and I'll build them and create the templates for you. These are literally, there's so many automations that you could do with emails, integrate with Notion, Google Calendar, etc. Now, now time to watch my first reaction on seeing this automation live. Okay guys, after 12 hours of studying how all of this automation stuff works, what an RSS is, what webhook is, how all of this actually works. I have actually done it. My goal was to create a YouTube title and description, LinkedIn post, Twitter thread, a blog post, and an email, all from just uploading my, <laughs> my YouTube video to a Google Drive folder. Now, if this honestly works, I'm gonna literally be, have my mind blown. All of this from just one, drag and drop so <laughs> this is my first time testing it. i've literally spent ages building this so without any further chat from me let's drag and drop this file and actually see whether it works and if it does work then i'm going to take you guys through exactly how to set this up for yourself using my step-by-step -step blueprint which i've just spent a long time creating so let's drag this video into here <laughs> and when it uploads the whole automation should start. So make.com. So this Google Drive integration automation here should run. So, okay, every 15 minutes. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna just click run and let it will pick this up. So this is the first one and it's created all of these fields in Airtable. So now I've got this, so it's picked it up. Now in Airtable, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna click a beginner workflow, which will be a YouTube video. So when I click this, it should automatically add the transformation, which is title and description. And then this webhook will be called. Then over here, I'm gonna go to this YouTube automation thing, which should then be running right now and creating all of these different parts. <laughs> and now we wait. So it's just created the description. It's just created the YouTube title and now it's creating, oh my God. <laughs> it's literally just created all the blog posts. <laughs> Dan, <laughs> I've just done it. The automation where it literally does everything. <laughs> oh my God, this is actually crazy. Now let's see whether it fills in each one of these tabs separately. Will it run? Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, it's actually doing it. <laughs> oh my God, it's actually done it. Okay, so now all I need to do is make it change. Oh, it's in review as well. Oh my God, it's literally done it. Guys, it's actually done it. <laughs> it's actually done it. So let me check these out. Pop these full screen. So this is a LinkedIn post. Then this is a Twitter. Oh my God. For the latest juicy details, check out my latest YouTube video. Trust me, this one's a game changer. Email copy. Oh my God. Secret. Unlock the secret side hustle you can start now for free. Are you broke teenager? Ready to dive in? <laughs> and then blog post. Attention broke teenager. And reap. Yo, honestly, this is sick. So now let me take you through how to actually implement this into your own business because Make has allowed all of this to be automated with basically one click. A YouTube automation, LinkedIn automation, Twitter thread automation, email and blog post. This doesn't blow your mind guys. And to show you individually, these different ChatGPT prompts are so basic. So it will now be my job to go through and create the best 
chat GBT prompt for each one of these content sources. And then the better my prompt is, then the better obviously this automation is gonna be. And imagine showing this to a client or as a content creator, imagine having this implemented for your business. <laughs> and I'm just gonna make the ChatGPT prompt better. And this is, <laughs> I'm so gassed. If you guys wanna try make, it'll be the top link in the description. You'll be able to get 30 day free on the pro plan. And then after that, it's only $18 a month. It's so cheap for the amount of time and money that you're gonna save using this. Remember to go check out the different templates and other ways that you can automate your business and just have a play around with the different things that you could do within this application. And that's a wrap on the video. I hope you guys have found this valuable. If you have, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you're new. And if you want me to make more more videos like this about automations that I'm implementing into my business, let me know in the comments. If you start seeing me being omnipresent all over social media, you'll know why. <laughs> That's a wrap on today's video. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you guys next week. Your boy's Gonski.